Hey guys, so today I'm going to take a look at four expeditions. Essentially, I know what four more of them will be. They will be the Gear Hulk. So obviously, um, you will have this is the green one. You will have the red one, the blue one, the white one, and the black one as expeditions, which they are now calling masterpieces. Which they in this set they call it the Calidas Inventions. So they are the inventions. Hang a back walkers back. I think that's an amazing selection. Uh, definitely one of the strongest artifacts. It's very gold. And these will be in foil. You will have the chance of actually playing them in limited should you be lucky enough to open them. It's one in every 144 booster packs. In my previous video, I said I'm a little skeptical because it seems like they just wanted you to buy more lottery tickets, essentially. Uh, so you can get one of these but I mean it is additional value kind of so will it make the game more expensive I'm not sure what it's going to do um, I mean ex I thought Zendikar expeditions were something unique to Zendikar and something we wouldn't see for a while but now we have a another rarity even above mythic the foil mythic rarity at one in every 144 booster packs it really does seem like we are playing the lottery that being said these cards will be gorgeous and they will be extremely valuable some of them we have mana crypt mana crypt was recently reprinted but this was a 200 dollars card before reprints and this is going to be a really pretty foil i mean you can just look at them it's all gold and you know, people are telling me that the vehicles are made from brass and i guess this could be brass but I think it's gold it's beautiful and should you open one of these in your sealed pool you can play it in limited and pretty much just win the game every time it comes out you probably even want a mulligan until you get it because it will be so good it'll be so good in that type of limited and sealed play and next would be gauntlet of power we will probably see some of the most valuable non-reserve list cards gauntlet of power is pretty good I've always liked it. It's fun for EDH and it's pricey. It's definitely pricey and up there in terms of how much it costs. So what other reprints do you want to see? Um, I'm assuming all of them will be artifacts in this particular set. What other cards do you feel like are just too expensive and you would love to get a uh, expedition of them? Very exciting news. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to take it because it does add a rarity above Mythic the foil mythic which is one in every 144 booster packs and seems kind of mm, seems like we're turning this you know into like a lottery system where if you have if you own a distributor um if you're a distributor or if you're a store this definitely helps you because you can see you know a ton of these or a significant amount of these and add it to your revenue but for the average player to say, hey, you have to open 144 booster packs just to get one of these, one of the 50 of these in a, the block, um, and not even guaranteed which one, getting the one that you want, uh, you'd probably just be better off buying them. Anyway, bye guys.